Hi there, it's Shell and Clint. Hello everybody. So, um, it's Easter <laughs> and I felt like making a video, so and Clint thought he would join me out here. People get sad when uh, we're not, don't have our normal setup. <laughs> Like, no, no kitties, and they're like, where are the kitties? Well, some of you, some of you are like, I'm glad you don't have the kitties. I love, I love them, but they can certainly be a handful, that is for sure. This sure. is a fun package. I imagine it's fun from Miss Betty. Um, she does a lot of digital kits. And so these are kind of like her off, um, gotta say, save this kind of paper if you guys get it. This is perfect for, um, spines of journals. But yeah, um, so these are, she print, you print the same thing when you're doing a digital kit. And make sure it's like the colors you want, you know, everything's in the same area, that kind of thing. So she said, I'm going to send you some. And I said, oh, I'll take a few of them. <laughs> <laughs> That's kind of scary. But she's shown me her. I said, You haven't seen my. Uh, I said, I have plenty of stuff. But I wouldn't mind some off prints or whatever they're called because I think we could always use them, you know. So I will tag her thing below. Look at this. I mean, just ones Ooh. that she's printing. I need to like send her a case of paper mm -hmm. <laughs> but there was just something on here maybe that she didn't care for and so she you know would print it over and over to see what she wanted you know what she liked what she didn't like because I mean you could even just use a small area of it I'm looking for the next one so do it I'm excited about the next one. I think this one is that uh, one. this one or the next one. That one. Oh, it's bicycle yeah. in the camera. Well, this is that one that she worked on when she, um, for Clint's finger. finger, yeah, to help him help oh, us wow. out. So yeah, but these Those are. are I mean, you can use anything like this for. So I'm like, oh, just send it. Here's our thing, the Rambling Crafter. Mm -hmm. But send me some, but I'll use them for backgrounds. I mean, look at that. Isn't that cute? Right now, I'm kind of thinking about the book that we're on right now. So, it says Easter on it. But we could put like a Tim Holtz thing right there. That's cute. I might keep it. Just to kind of, but yeah. So, she sent me a few. <laughs> mm -hmm. Uh hope you have some left. Glad I drove down, didn't have to walk and carry it back home. Yes, it was this massive thing, you know, the, we are working on, like, anything, um, what am I thinking, flowers, so, flowers and gardens and, oh, look at that, that one's pretty. And I, I don't know if she meant to have, you know, the stripes across. Sometimes my computer messes up. Well, she's been printing on all kinds of goodies. So, yeah, that's what this package is. Clint's like, I want to see what's in it. Ooh, look at that one. And this is on a heavier paper, so almost cardstock. Maybe I do need to send you some, some paper. Oh, so pretty. I mean, these are fun. I love, you know, mess ups anyways because you can just use them. And I mean, these are perfect for um, Betty for journaling cards since they're already on that paper. So I might be cutting out a bunch of them and just putting them away for journaling cards. So Betty's is, uh, her Etsy is Betty's Custom Designs. She has recently started making and she's made a lot. I mean, she was making like one a day for a while. So she does have, oh, I love that. She does have these digitals totally complete in her store. Betty's Custom Designs. 
and I think even now she's sharing that's pretty she's sharing how to make them make digital kits and wow, we always have tons of people say how you know I don't because I don't make them but some people are like how you know tell me how to make digital kits so it might be what you're looking for I haven't looked at it yet but I will Betty I promise her and her hubby spent the weekend which you know this past weekend uh, down at the uh, ooh, that's so pretty down at the ocean the coast I think is what they call it <laughs> oh my goodness look at all this I'm not sure what printer she has I think she told me but I can't remember like I said right now I am just looking for pieces that I can um, put in these journals I wonder if there is, there might be purple. But see, so, I mean, you're going to see the same thing over and over because something happened, she didn't like it, so she changed it. And then she printed it to see if she liked it the way she, she changed it, and that's what a lot of people do. Holy moly, we could make tons of journals out of these. <laughs> See, like this is totally different and I'm not even sure what she came up with there's so many combined in here that I haven't seen you know the finished one except for like the uh, steampunk one look at that cute little bunny love that so I do have plans oh my gosh this is my favorite oh that's cool <laughs> I love green. So yeah. Ooh, look at that one. Isn't that pretty? Wow, wow, that's good. So this will be fun to go through every single time, you know. Just because. Ooh, and I, I love that design. For journals. So there's purple. Um I'm going to make a TN using some of the purples from the kit because I still had some pages. So I'm going to pull these. I'm going to cover, don't I? Which I, I think I'm going to, huh? You know, do that next? Okay. No, I don't know that I'm going to do a cover really. Oh. Uh, like a fancy cover. I think I'm just going to do a paper cover. Oh. Okay. So, but we will have to do, um, we'll be working on Tina's project yeah. before too long and we do have digitals already that we haven't used so I'm just going to use those <clears throat> but some of those are going to be perfect you know what you should do have you thought about turning them over and using the back too Betty just because I was thinking saving paper I don't know well some of them she does put on the back there's only one so far <laughs> that she printed on the back oh She's using anything she can get her hands on. Look, that's a piece of cardboard. <laughs> oh, and you know I love these. She actually sent me this, I think. I'm on her design team. I mean, I am her design team. <laughs> She's so cute. She's sending me all this stuff, and I'm like, really? Are you sure you want to do that? Anytime she finishes a kit, she's like, here. Oh, nice. So, it'd be kind of fun to do her work from her kits. Oh, I love them, Betty. Thank you. Wait, that had. I bet I could use some of that in this journal now. Okay, we'll keep those out. Sometimes you just need, you know. So there you go, honey. That's what we got cool. for this Betty. Betty's my new best friend. <laughs> we have so much in common, it's crazy. Uh, very crazy. Except she has nine kids. And I have ten cats. She has nine <laughs> kids? Holy smokes, she has a big family. She does, yeah. It's funny, I think like the first half of them were girls, and then the second half of them were boys. So that's kind of interesting, isn't it? Okay, guys, so 
Uh, my idea today is to make paper clips. Uh, so we'll pull out, you know, all the little scraps and stuff that we have. But we're going to make paper clips and maybe something else. We'll see, see how much time we have. We spent 10 minutes going through Betty's stuff. It's not bad, though. Today is Clint's birthday, so it was on the 4th. Of course, the thing I got him for his birthday is coming from overseas, so... <laughs> He's not going to get it for a while, but I give him all kinds of stuff all the time, so... But I did make him a carrot cake, and I was going to record that, but I turned on the dishwasher, and you can't do both, so... I'll make another one. I make one every year, sometimes a couple times a year. Okay, so here's all my scraps um, to make paper clips out of. I thought we'd just make them for the journal itself. And then we'll kind of go through <coughs> and through all my goodies. I could have Clint do that if he wanted to, but see if there's anything that could go into this journal, but you don't have to. It's not that big of a deal. He likes to just sit there and not do anything. Yep. He just woke up. He took two naps. I tried to take my second nap, but little girl decided that she wasn't going to stay in the bedroom with Daddy. Nope. And when she's out, she sits there and yells at all the other cats. So, uh, what's her name? Yeah, her. Holy girl old girl <coughs> so and then I got up and I was like come on you want to go in there nope don't want to mama so I got to just hear her screaming <laughs> I know she's like well you know I was thinking yesterday we didn't really let her out very much Maybe that was it. so that could have been it I'm just pulling these really big pieces I mean ones like this we could actually turn into a paper clip. I have a couple of ideas. So, yeah. But I, I wasn't going to make a video today, and I was like, I really want to. I was watching Gail this morning, and man, she was just having a blast playing and doing stuff. She got some Tim Holtz people, and she was just laughing and giggling and so happy to be in her craft room. And I was like, you know, I want to go craft. <laughs> So typically I put three to four um, things in a paper clips. So I thought about doing fabric ones, of course, because I have all that fabric. But I think I'm going to go with these, these three. And I'll kind of show you what my plan is here in a minute. What are you doing? Cleaning up? No. Oh. Mm -hmm. One could hope, huh? Mm -hmm. Oh, you're playing. I think that cut's pretty nice. What do you think? I think that cut looks good. Clint's playing with the the new fabric cutter thing. It's not really a pink It isn't, is it? And there's another another one, but I think it's identical to that. Really sharp, so don't touch them if, you, if you're playing with them. But yeah, so it's kind of, yeah, she, Gail, of course, you know, she's showing all her Tim Holtz, new Tim Holtz goodies, so I now have a huge cart of <laughs> Tim Holtz goodies. <laughs> Haven't decided if I'm going to purchase them, but I do have them in my cart. Oh, okay, so these are kind of fun. Uh, you're going to need something to cover the back with, put the paper clip on. And I'm thinking about turning it into a shaker. Wouldn't that be kind of fun? You're right, it will be. So, some of these other pieces that I'm not that fond of, like this one. You know, we could still use that as a pocket, just on the inside. I'm going to put that aside for our pocket. Um, that could be a pocket. Look at that. Isn't that cute? Just that single ladybug. 
but like, let's see what I have that would fit on these. Such beautiful paper. I love it. But, and it doesn't have to like cover the whole back. So what I do need though is some kind of plastic for the scent for the, the side. So let me go look and see if I have like page protectors and I'll be right back. Okay, so I found this. These are page protectors, but they're pretty sturdy, so I think that will work. I had to remind my step myself <laughs> where everything is. I need to kind of get out here and organize. <clears throat> there they are, look. So excited. I knew I had little ladybugs. Here's a little bee. I was hoping I could find these. Pull that piece off because it's a little sticker. And we'll use those in our little shaker cards. Do I have anything else besides ladybugs and the bee? Here's one more ladybug. I'm going to put him out. Here's a little bee. It's a little button, maybe. I might have to cut off the shank and glue them together. So sometimes I put like um, buttons in, in there. So if I had like itty bitty beads would work. Oh, here's another bee. And then I'll show you what I'm talking about. But I was just asking plant, I wonder where I put those. Here they are. Here so. Okay, so let me go and see if I can find like seed beads or something really tiny that would fit. You'd think I'd be more organized, but you guys know how I am. You're just here because we're just crafting with shell today. Okay. Okay, so I have some goodies here. Here's a bunch of little beads. Uh, some flower. They're kind of like stencils. Not stencils, sequins. And some of those. And then these little beads. You could do, um, these were little gems. But you could do, oh, I think then. Sorry, this thing just fell. It's not charging. I could do glitter, it's just not my favorite. There it is, okay. I need to figure out a way to <sighs> have all this stuff working. Okay, so let me grab my sewing machine. Actually, not quite yet. Not quite yet. Open one of these. I think I got these at a, who knows. Oh, I got these at Salt Lake City. I remember stopping by there. Oh, yeah, when Sis oh, and I went on from... vacation. Yeah. We, um, yeah. Come back in here. That way they stay good. Yeah, I was like, I know I have plastic somewhere. I can't find it. <laughs> then I remembered. Man, I thought maybe I would use some more of that one. Okay, that's not going back in there. I'm not going to fight with it. So this will have to go back over there. That's okay. Well, I might have got them at a yard sale. I don't remember. We did go to one. But, I mean, it's really thick plastic. So I thought that would work. So I need my scissors. And I think I'm going to cut it off on the edge here this you can do this with anything it doesn't have to you know be special paper or anything like that and then that will will glue it like on the front actually we're going to sew it and we'll have goodies inside of it so let's see what else I can not that one. Where's my other ones? This one. Yeah, that'll work. So I'm just kind of making. 
making it a little bit smaller than my piece. That one. This one. And these are pretty inexpensive, so I mean you can have those the larger page protectors or whatever. But it's not um, not necessary. Some people use like plastic office stamp sets or something like that. But they're, they're really a cute little thing to put in here. Do I want to try for four? This one is just cute. I love that. So let's just see if I can get like one more bunch off of this one. We could do it like that and maybe trim it. Yeah, we'll do that. Like that. There we go. Okay. So we have four. This one, can I save it? Probably not. Okay. <clears throat> now we will grab my sewing machine. That's what I keep cleaning around for. <laughs> it's a good thing too. I know, right? Let me move all these papers and stuff. So I think what I'm going to do, hun, is put a um, shelving right there. To put it on? To either put the sewing machine on or to put everything in front of me and then just sl slide idea. this back. That's kind of what I'm thinking, but you know, you know how I am, how it goes when I'm thinking, hush. Mm -hmm. Okay, so, let me see, can you guys see what I'm doing? So this one, I am just, it's slick, so that's going to concern me, but I'm going to see if we can't make it work. Make sure there's an opening in the top, <laughs> or one, one of the edges. doing a straight stitch and I think I just messed up because it's kind of gathering. Not sure. Let's see. We're gonna try it. <laughs> okay, it doesn't have to be perfect, you know, but I think it'll be okay. It's coming off a little bit. the hiccups. <laughs> Sorry about that. Ooh. Okay, so I want to do that different. So let me see. This one is, I'm just going to have that side. This one I don't think it's going to matter which way I sew it. If those were the hiccups, they're gone though. Hopefully. <laughs> I'd say that. And be like, no, we're still here. <laughs> I just looked at you. Maybe that was the whole thing. Oh, <laughs> well, she's clever, isn't she? <laughs> I feel clever. Two, we could actually 
kind of do something fun with that. Yeah, you don't need two necessarily two layers like this. You could just put one, but since I did two on all of them, if you put something behind each of them, it almost kind of gives it a 3D look. It's kind of fun. I've seen that like on cards. Oh, and of course I should have said if you want to put something on your <laughs> your card first before you sew on the plastic, then <coughs> Michelle, you should have done that. Uh, I'm such a goober head. Aw, oh, Betty. <laughs> uh, she always laughs when I call myself a goober head. We'll have to trim them for sure. This one is one that has it on, no, just one side. So, shall we do, yeah, we'll do it like that. Yeah, we definitely have to trim them just because I have a little bit of uh, like the plastic on the side and stuff. Uh-oh, see, I knew I should have done it differently. bowed up on me again because I don't learn my lesson the first time. Okay. Okay. So we will need this here back in a minute. But now we're going to figure out what we want to do. That I could even use that, I think, for paper, but I don't know if that's the best idea. So I'm going to just kind of trim around. Maybe I tell you, those scissors are not. Once you use them for paper, that they just totally run. Get mm -hmm. run. Ruined. Uh -uh. Okay, that's that paper is so darn cute. Okay. I really love that paper. Again, it is listed below if you're if you're interested in finding any. I was looking, I was looking at something, Windows on Amazon, because uh -uh. we still haven't put our window out here, we <coughs> put one in the screen, and or in the door, and Clint said, well, if you have a screen, then you won't need that cumbersome screen that we bought last year for it, because it's kind of like falling apart and everything already, and it just wasn't attached well, so I went on Amazon, I'm looking up, um, windows you know that would fit and they have like playhouse windows specifically engineered for sheds yeah <laughs> like 30 bucks i was like really <coughs> because i thought well we'll put one in the door that has a screen and kind of kill two birds with one stone but not always that smart Okay, guys, so let's see. Since I do have two layers, I thought it'd be kind of fun to maybe put saying or something in the back one. And I thought we'd even look at the snarky. See if there's anything that would kind of pop out that would kind of be funny or... Um, but who knows. I may be wrong, but I doubt it. <laughs> Well, I mean, like, this one would work, not necessarily for this book, but when in doubt, vacation, that's not horrible. Um, in my defense, I was left unsupervised. It's a beautiful day to leave me alone. 
I actually saw a t-shirt like that. <laughs> and I was thinking, oh, I should get that because it was on sale. <laughs> I wish more people were fluent in silence. Uh, I don't know. I just thought, you know, we'll just see, see if there's anything in here. Just because I have one and I never use it. But I was thinking, wouldn't it be fun to just do a snarky journal? Okay, let's go to these. <laughs> go to my tried and true ones. Um, I was thinking maybe like spring or... S's. Strength. You know, it could just be something simple. Do any of these have... I mean, this one, where's the wings? There's one that has wings on it. Put that on that. That one, let me show you how I'm going to do it. Wish me look. Because <laughs> I'm thinking, uh oh. That's what I mean. I should have decorated them before I, uh, before I did anything else. So, then what we'll do is put it upside down. So, we can get it right side up. If I can get it to stick to my scissors. Oh. <laughs> That's just who I am. <laughs> Nuts. Oh, geez. Okay, let's try that again. It's a windy day, isn't it, baby? It is really windy. It's nice, though. It was really warm outside. We turned off all of our heaters which sometimes we keep them on seriously until July. Oh yeah. But, and you know, we'll probably have to turn them on later. But you have it on there. Slide that in, see if we can get it to stick. Hold it down. There we go. Ha <laughs> ha, I made it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> of course it would have been easier the other way, but Gotta do what you gotta do, huh? Do we have anything that says flowers or my friend? These are his big chat. Yeah, they're just called big chat. So, um, let's see. And you can come up with different ideas and stuff, you know, because they're all individual words. Oh, here's one. Just says beauty. That would be pretty on any of them, wouldn't it? Maybe on this one. This one's kind of, kind of plain. Let's see. How do I want it? Like that, I think. Where's that beauty? It's even beautiful. Delightful would work. So again, it's not as fun, anyways. If it's not a challenge, right? <coughs> And since it's going under the second layer, make sure I put it in the right spot. Whoa, I don't want it down that far. <laughs> okay. Let's see if I can get it to move. There we go. Perfect. Okay, I got two with the words. Now I'm having fun. <laughs> Charming. Um, let's see. They might have flowers and stuff like in this one. Fay, fear, fly. Ooh, can you hear that? Holy smoke. Happiness. See, and you could write like happiness is. I'm just gonna see if I can spell out something. Happiness is what, hun? Oh, you, there's not a is. Well, that doesn't help. <coughs> happiness. You no. could always put choose happiness. Ooh, choose. Ooh, there's a choose. Good job, Daddy O. Mm -hmm. Thank you. <laughs> Yeah, you just want to 
to make sure you have them the right side up when you're choose happiness I know you would have, you would come up with something for me. This one I might actually can just pop it in. The opening's quite large, so that's a good thing. And this isn't gluing on top of plastic, so that's one reason I was thinking, well, I should have put it on the paper in the back. There we go. Choose happiness. One more. I was thinking about just plain beautiful, but maybe even beautiful blessings. Better be beautiful. Be beautiful. No, I don't like the be beautiful. What about beautiful attitude? Beautiful destination. Yeah. De delightful dreams. Um, perfectly, I'm trying to think of something so I'm not using two from the same, um, yeah, from the same letter. Mm. Sunshine, um, what do you guys think? Wishes, wishes, beautiful wishes. I like charming. We already did charming, didn't we? No. Charming. You would think they would have like flowers or something, you know, charming heart, charming imagination, charming people, sometimes charming. <laughs> Uh, okay, what did you decide on? I like the one we should uh, Beautiful attitude, what? I can't remember what it was now. <laughs> you read off so many. What about lost. charming destination? I think that's kind of cool. What do you think? Okay. Glenn doesn't like it. We'll move on. Charming. Charming life, charming memories, charming ourselves, charming strengths, charming sunshine. I don't have to use charming, mm -mm. but you don't know what it was, huh? Sunshine and rain, maybe something like that would be kind of cool. Yeah, of course, they don't have. They have sunshine, but they don't have rain. <laughs> Charming memories? No. I like that. Do you like charming memories? Yeah. Let's just skip it with that one. Uh, I wish you guys could talk louder so I could hear you. <laughs> uh, tell ya. You okay, Daddy? Mm -hmm. Glenn's like, what are you going to do? Are you going to open that package from Betty? I don't open packages until I talk usually to the person and make sure, or I don't open them until they're on, um, until on, I'm on camera. And sometimes it drives Clint nuts. He's like, when are you going to open these packages? I don't know. Mm -hmm. Like three days after we got them or something. When are you going to open them? I want to see. I love to see <laughs> the different things. Well, and so many people have different things than we do, you know. Oh, exactly. Betty was talking to me. She's, like I said, on the coast, Florida coast. And uh, she asked if we, if I'd ever had Tupelo honey. I've never had that. So you guys have to let me know what you think of it. Because, you know, every year we make uh, cough medicine from um, wild, a wild plant. And our honey always crystallizes, but this one is not supposed to crystallize. And I was thinking, man, that would be perfect because it's so annoying to put all this work into making this honey because it's like a six-week process. 
and then you have to really dig it out because you can't, it won't, it's crystallized and you can't figure out how to get it out of there. And I was thinking, ooh. And it's raw honey. Yeah, we got raw honey, but there's this raw honey too. It's just the flower or whatever doesn't crystallize. She, yeah, she sent me some information on it. Yeah. yeah. And it's just, it, I think it said it was only like the flowers bloom for like four to six weeks and that's it. That's what you so they saying. have to. Interesting. It is really interesting. Okay, I've guys. I've heard of it before. Okay. I've never heard, song, heard of it. I've heard of it in a song. Really? Uh -huh. They sang about Tupelo. <laughs> yeah. That is very interesting. Okay, so in the other uh, the other little pouch, we are going to put, yeah, the the goodie. Um, I did have this kind of stuff, and I was thinking, ooh, wouldn't that be fun to kind of tie on because we've used it in the journal. So I don't know where my blue one is though. That one eyelash on there it is. So, but yeah, so we could use like one for here, or maybe the purple one for that one. So, kind of show you, kind of show you what I'm talking about. And we'll just go in there. I'm gonna go ahead and just put a little bit of glue. I think I'm gonna double that. Paint crinkly crap went really good with your book. Didn't it though? Yeah. Pink crinkly crap went really well with the book. It's almost a salmon-y color, isn't it? it is, yeah. Pretty. Yeah, it really turned out really pretty. I, I really like that book. And I was thinking I can't really finish the book until I get my order mm -hmm. um, to finish the cover. I forgot, and that's not going to be here until the end of the week. Wow. Yeah, it was a really long. So I'm just popping those in. I probably should have done that after I put my goodies inside. But then I have, here's like a blue. Blue and green. I think they'll go perfect with this one. Pour some of those little beads in. Oh, so cute. I love that. Uh, our little and the fun thing about this shaker is if you put the things right side up, they're not going to um, flip over. I think that's all I want in there. So all I have to do now is just kind of go um, sew it shut. So I'm going to set that one aside. That one's cute. I love it. This one, let's see. Let me go for red. I don't have any red, but I do have these little guys. I can open it. These are like miniature, teeny, teeny, tiny. I'm going to try my teeth. Jeez, um, pliers. Can't see, can't see. Okay, let's try that one. Got these from, oh man, I just broke it. <laughs> Got those from Gareth when he was selling. And man, they're like, I think they're for like your nails or something, but you can put them on your nails. Man, they're so tiny. Again, I'm just kind of making sure it's in that one only. Let's see what kind of mess I can get here. And then I'll kind of, kind of go down in there. Oh, I love that one. I think I'm gonna put a bee in. Take off the little sticky part. These are so fun, guys. I got a bee and a, wasn't it a bee and a ladybug on the same picture? Yeah. Clint's mom just loved it. Loved that picture. 
There we go. Cute. Huh. Oh, I like it. Isn't that adorable? So let's put this. See if I can get it to shut. Huh? It seems like it's closed. We'll see. Um, pink and I don't know if I care for this one. This one's too uh, childlike. Let's see. Beauty. Maybe the squares. These are kind of darker color. So you can put a couple of a couple of colors together. Like I said, you could use glitter. I just felt like the the plastic to me always has static. static. Yeah. So I was kind of thinking, well. I mean, they're going to, you're going to see some that are the color and some that's the back, but I'm not going to worry about that. Uh, let's put this light green. It's much easier, though, with those pliers. I'm not going to turn them all over, though, individually. I think that would be kind of a headache for me. And I would just think, what am I going to do with all these? That's kind of cute, huh? Want more pink. And you so. gotta sew the tops of them. The yeah, then I'm gonna sew the top shut. Put some more red in there. Then you can put it like fiber before you show them. Sew them shut. If you want to. What are you doing with that? Dip. Mm-hmm. My favorite. I want to get me a pair that I can use with uh, scissors, uh, paper. Yeah. There we go. That's kind of cute. There is a lot of silver, but like I said, I'm not going to stress. And this one has a B in here. So I am going to add... Do I want one of each? Nope. I'm just going to add the butterfly. Now look at the fabrics in a minute. And this one has all kinds of pretty colors, so I might put that green. Just so cute. Such a cute idea. I don't know if anyone else has ever made these, but I've been making them on and off for a while. Um, let's add a ladybug and a bee. Be like a friend, friendly needing ladybug, bee, and a snail. There we go. Cute. Okay. I think we're done with these. And let me see what fibers I, I do want. This fiber. We have more blue and purple. I think what I'll do is put it on the paper piece. Put the glue there. Hold it. So cute, guys. I love it. Okay, that one. This one, let's see if we can't find get some of this pink. The pink and yellow. That'd be pretty. I think I just want one piece for this one. This is just gonna hold it so when I I have made these and put like um, buttons. Which is really cute. Cute idea. Idea. And then this one, let's see. Let's see the pink. And the Cutting it in the middle. Like I tell them, don't cut that in the middle. <laughs> you cut it in the middle, then you have two ends. But I you do. can find very easily. <laughs> That's true, huh? I mean, it's not like it's something you're crocheting with or something. It's, you're going to cut it up anyway. Wasn't you're going to have a lot more than two ends. You know what? <laughs> yeah, that's true, huh? Okay, little guy, get back, get back in the bottom. 
I might have too much of that stuff. Oops. See? She's in the wrong spot. Come here, you. Let's go in between this one and this one. I think I'm going to pull some of that out because I think it's just too much. You guys are right, whoever was saying that. Somebody probably was. Okay, now let me put him in here. And that, this, since it's kind of bowed, it will, um, Give your little charms a little place, you know, more room to move. To move around. I'm going to have to get me a little trash can out here, I think. Mm -hmm. That way all my... Oh, man, it's pulled. <laughs> Is that the one? I think so. Good grief, Michelle. Okay, get back in there. Just yanked it on out of there. Okay. Got like all this stuff. Need a little tiny one like right beside me. Okay. Actually, you know, I saw someone. I was fixing to pull that again. I saw someone and they use like a little container. And I was thinking we have all those kitty containers. Mm -hmm. Trash cans. I could put them in there and then throw them away when they're full. Okay, hon, can you hand me that? <laughs> Got it? Yeah. Sorry. That's all right. Okay, we're going to close these shut. I think I'm going to close them with a zigzag. So, I don't have my thing on for a while. Yeah, Clint, it's letting it breathe. I would show it to you. But it's kind of gross. I don't think it's that bad. Let's go and see how it's going to grow the, the nail. It sure don't look like it. I think it's but you didn't ask me, did you? I know what you think. Uh, I bet it smells yummy in the house, you know what? Just like in that, yeah. We have a ham. Did I already tell you guys that? Probably. Ham, carrot cake, and mashed potatoes. Baked beans, and what are those other things? Deviled eggs. <laughs> Oops, I didn't even change that thing. Just a cute finishing look. You could go all the way around again if you wanted to, but I don't see any sense in it. So there we go. Do these other ones real quick. And I put that fiber there for a purpose. So. good and we I told him you we or did I tell him that Clint just took a, a nap and then we got up ate a snack yeah I think I told you guys oh man right. yeah I didn't hold it like I should have yeah we got up and ate a snack and lay back down and went back to sleep well you did the cats and birds I don't know why I call it I might have told Kateri that. I can't remember. <laughs> told somebody. Told one of my friends that check up on me. <laughs> Michelle, how are you guys doing? Let me tell ya. <laughs> this one is so cute, guys. that too because I don't think she was out much yesterday. Yeah, I really And that's all. Hold on. That part. You got it? Yeah, I got it. You can also put like a table right there yeah. too. For that. <clears throat> okay, so let me show you. We'll finish these up before we run out of time. <laughs> But yeah, if I had like a little thing, I could just pop mm -hmm. pop in all my little threads. But yeah, 
I had another plan for today, but I don't think we're going to have time mm -hmm. because I know I've already been like almost 20 minutes on top of what I'm doing now. Okay, so we have the four. Oh, they're so cute. So now we're going to take some charms. You know how I am with charms. I've got to have them. <coughs> and, huh? It's starting to cool off in here now. Feels good. You can turn it back on if you think we need it. No, I would I maybe put it back on the. Well, if we just shut the window. Pilot? You don't think it's going to freeze? No, it's supposed, supposed it looks to like it's supposed to rain. It ain't supposed to do anything. Okay. If it is, if it gets low, you're going to have to run out here and start it because I started leaving my glue out. Oh, yeah. No. It's just... And some of these I might have to cut some off, but I want big holes. I can add my charms. Let's see, Let's see how far I want Yeah, I love this, um, these fibers, Kateri. And I have tons of fibers too. Clint's neighbor. Ma Clint's mom's neighbor. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm gonna look for a heart. I have a big hole. Her niece or somebody, maybe her daughter, I can't remember, but she um, would get all this fancy yarn that neither mom nor her neighbor would use. So she'd be like, Michelle, I'm gonna bring it up to you. I use it, I just use it on junk journal stuff instead. Not the best thing to knit or crochet with. Uh, when my mother had cancer, well, she had cancer until she passed, but I would make her um, hats out of this type of yarn. But the one I made, I made one, and it was brown, so it looked like her hair, you know, because she didn't have any hair. And then I made one that was kind of, it wasn't quite these colors, it was more um, autumn. And my grandmother said, Michelle, I hate that hat. Why did you send her that hat? <laughs> well, I was just thinking of it as a hat, not necessarily as a uh, a wig, you know. <laughs> the brown one looks so good on her, but that one's awful. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, it was just something I did. I had just started learning to knit at the time, I think, and, yeah, I think it was, I'm pretty sure I knitted them. And, you know, once in a while I'd send her a package and she would have her hats in there. They say when you have cancer and you lose your hair, you don't realize that your, um, how, how it hurts your head when you lay on pillows and stuff. Hmm. Yeah, because you don't have any cushion, cushion yeah. yeah, on your head. So I don't know, but so when one of my friends from high school, she had cancer, and so I sent her some so that maybe she could um, snuggle up with them and stuff. But I'm thinking I might just put. This. There's two of them here, but they're going to be really hard to tie, so I'm trying to figure out how to make it work. Might just tie them together. Because I really didn't leave them long enough. Maybe like this. But yeah, they're really hard to, <laughs> hard to do anything with. But on cute little journals like this, I think they're adorable. Uh, different fibers and stuff inside. So I need to go through all mine and put some in the, in the Etsy. I do have, I don't know if I've ever mentioned it, but I do have the smaller Edith Holden Etsy pages, or Etsy, Edith Holden pages that are about five and a half by seven and a half available in the store, so you can kind of use them and not have to cut them down. That's kind of fun. Oh, I love that. That's cute. So I do have that and other things in the Etsy. And Clint is now taking orders for more ink blenders. So 
I didn't even use these little flowers. Those would have been cute. Oh well. It is what it is, isn't it? Do I want... Oh! That butterfly would be adorable. Because it's like a little family of friends. Little meeting of friends there. Yeah, this one's supposed to be up, I think, on Wednesday, and we're supposed to be in Norwood then. So, that's our plan. So, hopefully I'll get some, some, what's it called? Some film, filmage? Oh, yeah. Some footage. And I'm just looking for something with a big, here's a little love. on. I'll just put, well, it shouldn't take me very long. We'll do that real quick. Okay, so we got four. Oh, so cute. So cute, guys. What about this paper? We could use it for some of them. It doesn't have to be perfect. So you just want really nicely. Such a bright color. So I've really never had a reason to use it. And we shall put our paper clips together. <laughs> okay, can't be that hard. Okay, there we go. And then I have these little clips. For some reason, I always do the small side. I glue that side down. Move around the edge. I think Clint's asleep. Uh -huh. uh, sound like you're breathing hard. I'm getting tired again. Uh -huh. And then... It's going to be a long, long week, guys. It's going to be a long be a summer week. and... Spring. Still recovering from Thursday. <laughs> I would have taken another nap and then I got to thinking, oh, I need to do this, this, and this first. I might make his cake before I put the ham in. Because I wanted the ham in for a couple of hours. And, you know, figure out I need to do this so I can use that pan to do this. To and it's just the two of us. But, you know, really, we still make large meals. We just don't make maybe as much as, like, if my sister or we were having a huge family come visit. But we still have, because for the most part, it's always just the two of us. We just do our thing, don't we, baby? Mm -hmm. Oh, so cute. Oh. Wait. <laughs> Wait, come off. You guys know I do this all the time. What you do? Oh, they know. To put it on the wrong side? I need it to go like this. <laughs> I was thinking of up and down for oh. some reason, but it's a long ways. I just happened to look at it. I was just looking where the ribbon was. I do this quite often. <laughs> Make sure. Okay, that's. Because I want it to go at the top of my pages. Jeez. This one person said, well, if you wouldn't talk so much, then. And I said, I'm a rambler. If you don't like it, then 
Move it on. Well, she kept saying stuff like that, and I was like, do you even pay attention to what the name of my channel is? <laughs> She's just not that bright to understand what that word is. I don't know, but that was the last time she ever said anything. She's like, well, if you wouldn't quit, if you quit talking so much. Well, if you quit watching, I wouldn't be talking so much, huh? Exactly. At least she wouldn't hear me talking, would she? That's what I'm saying. Yeah. And I was like, you know. Well, she said this, what was it? Like this incessant, incessant, is that the word? Chattering is driving me crazy. And I'm like, uh, you better pay attention to whose channel you're on. I'm thinking hot dog. <laughs> Oh, you're welcome. I know, I should have. Oh, so cute, guys. Do I have that right? Yeah. <laughs> oh, geez, Louise. Okay. This one goes like that. Now I'm using art glitter glue in my bottle. I think I'm getting hungry though. I know I am. Yeah, our snack was just chip, chips and cheese. I didn't eat Kind of like nachos. Yeah. So it wasn't really very filling. Cool on it. Okay, so, we're almost done, guys. I know, you guys don't mind long, long videos. I make long videos because, especially when the house, you know, the lockdown started, I had people ask me to. So, and I just have never stopped. You're welcome. Cute. I'm not going to stick them in the book, I don't think. But then that kind of. Let's see this one, maybe. Isn't that cute? I love it, guys. What do you think? How cute those are. What do you think, huh? Oh, I can. So, let's put one in. I know I said I wasn't going to, but. Uh, show, show you what it looks like. I could probably just pop them all in. It's not going to take but a minute, huh? So, like this one, maybe I would put it here. And then it would just hang so, so cutely. That's adorable. I love that. And then I would put one in the back because if I don't, then I'll be like, have them all in the front. Don't you want three and three and four? It doesn't matter. I'm going to put two in the back and two in the front. I just thought you like uneven numbers. That's what. That's yeah, what it doesn't bother me so much because you're not going to really see it as much. Mm. And I considered three and then I thought, well, I could save one for the, um, the TN. But okay. I could put them all in here too. I always make another one. So that's how they look. What do you guys think? And having that little bit of fiber kind of pop out the top of the book. Yes. Isn't that cute? I love it. So we're going to wrap it up now. So thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure and hit that subscribe button. Give this video a thumbs up. And we'll see you guys in the next video. See you soon. Bye. Bye guys. Thanks for visiting. Tut zines everyone.